This has been an album that I would have listened to myself since I was a little kid. I'm very happy where I'm at at this stage of life. My face can grow a beard. <laughs> Always in the back of my mind, thinking to myself that, that theater and musical theater was just in my heart, that it was something that, gosh, at one point I want to do again. My parents took my brother and I to see shows, Sunday in the Park with George, Phantom of the Opera, Les Miserables. I mean, like, it was the brilliant score and singing that just knocks your socks off that made me walk out of each theater thinking to myself that I wanted to be the person doing that someday. If I die, let me die, let him Any song selection for any album starts with a list a mile long. You know, you can't sing everything. You kind of have to Think about the stuff that's right for your either your age or your voice type. Almost every song on the record I grew up loving. And then there are a few that I didn't really get to know very well growing up, um, that I got to know through the recording of this album. Demons will charm you with a smile. The album was recorded primarily in Los Angeles, and uh, the finishing of the hat, so to speak, was at Abbey Road. You know, to be able to take those vocals and then to experience the brilliance that only those musicians can, can bring to it. Um, you know, it's the reward. Take a look and you'll see into your imagination. Not only did I have the right production team to do this with, I felt like there were two people in Umberto Katika and Bernie Herms that truly understood the vision for this project. And that's all we need. Yeah, Umberto that, has engineered or co-produced most of my past records. I know how great Umberto and I can make music sound. Bernie has an extraordinary ability to get just the best vocals out of you. To now come back to this incredible material so many years later, and at a time that I feel is really right for me to record the material, I feel like my voice is in a mature place, uh, and also, I think my fans have been looking forward to an album like this for a long time. It's great that, um, that I can finally kind of sink my teeth into these songs that I've wanted to sing since I was in high school.